Good morning guys, it's Friday today. Uh, it's about 10 o'clock now. I took some time to sleep in after my late night. And now I'm going for breakfast and I'm taking my beach stuff because I'm just gonna go right to the beach. I'm gonna send under a hut today. Uh, I got burnt yesterday. Um, oh, now my leg changed. But you can kind of see my arm here and on my leg as well. So just in, I'm in the shade today. Uh, I may go in the pool, but yes, in the shade. <laughs> Uh, and tomorrow we're going on a full day excursion, so I have to get up, at, well, we have to leave at 7 a.m., so it's like getting up at 6. Um, and yeah, I finished my book on my Kobo, so I'm going to have to find another one. <laughs> um, I have some other ones on here, um, but I don't know if I feel like it. Uh, so, yes, I'm going to go for breakfast and hope there's nothing on my door this morning. <laughs> I spent most of the day in on the beach under one of the cover umbrella site things, um, but I did sign up for the an excursion that I think there's 11 of us doing it. So I think we're going to Tulum, and then we have well here it says Tulum, three zip lines, and then rappelling down into some caves, and then snorkeling to look at the stalagmites and stalactites, and then. Swimming in a cenotes, um, and then I think rappelling down into it, um, and then going on a four by four, <laughs> and walk to the jungle, snorkeling in no. Oh, I don't know, snorkeling on this beach or something. Or that was maybe that was in there. I don't know with flashlights. Yes. So, it's a full day thing, we have to leave at 7 a.m. tomorrow and it takes, we'll get back here around 4 o'clock. But yeah, there's a group of us going and I'm like, honestly, I'm like done with just sitting out on the beach. I downloaded a new book, but still, so I'm, yeah, happy to do an excursion. And, I mean, I've never been, I've never seen Tulum, I've never, you know, gone into the cenotes or anything, so I'm excited to explore a little bit. Um, so right now, I am going to go for lunch. So now it is almost four o'clock and I'm going with the bride and groom to their trash the dress photo shoot. So I'm gonna help my friend into her dress. And first they're going to one of the pools where the, like the infinity pools and they're gonna do some shots in the water and then we're gonna walk, I think it's about a kilometer up the beach um, where it's like way past the photographer like, I think scoped it out, um, past um, like the hotel area and like the condo area and it's a little calm um, because right now it's really wavy uh, and stormy so anyways a calm little bay area I think that they're gonna go in the ocean to do the rest of their shots so it's gonna look so amazing the photographer is a genius when it comes to photography so yeah the photos look so good so I'm excited to see it and just to get to help my friend with it <laughs> So they got some amazing shots. Uh, I'm like, I don't know if I would do a destination wedding. 
Uh, well, actually, I wouldn't because I know like not everyone would be able to come. Um, but I would so like take my dress on my honeymoon <laughs> just to get shots like that on the beach. They're so beautiful. And like that's just was looking through his like well for my little camera and then looking through his lens like or his camera. And I mean he's yeah like I said he's amazing. That's like before photo like touching anything up they already look phenomenal. So oh so sweet. Uh, anyway so now I'm going to have a shower get a whole bunch of sand off. I carried the dress back because she brought her bathing suit then changed into it like far away on the beach we walked about a kilometer and then I was like carrying it back like waddling with it in my arms so heavy because it's well three layers and it's like lace and then the underlayer anyway so yes I'm going to wash off all the stuff and, and then I'm going to have I'm going to the Italian place capers for dinner with a bunch of us oh okay I am off for dinner and I didn't bring enough dresses so I have to recycle I have one more dress top but it has to be worn while well, I brought like capri, black capri pants, um, like dress pants, but it's too hot to wear that. And I wore my black shorts today that now we're all sandy, so I have to wash them and they're just drying now. So I couldn't wear that. So I had to reuse my dress for today. But oh well, so I'm going to, yes, the Italian place capers. So after dinner, we went to the lobby and we played a game of trivia, um, actually three rounds. Um, the other bridesmaid, she organized it and brought it for all of us. We were in groups of three. My team lost, I think, almost every time. Um, they were pretty hard questions. Uh, so anyways, I'm back to my room now. It's about 11 o'clock, um, getting up at 6 a.m. Yeah, 6 a.m. tomorrow to go on our full day excursion. Um, but yeah, I just want to show you, you get a little kind of weather thing for tomorrow. So it's supposed to be um, cloudy and sunny with low 24, high 31 Celsius, or then low 76, high 81 Fahrenheit. And then just the events for tomorrow, but obviously we're gone all day. Anyways, I'm still really burnt. But yes, lots of sunscreen, lots of stuff. And yeah, so I'm going to go to bed after I put a lot of aloe vera on me and actually I'm going to pack my um, bag for tomorrow so I can just grab it and then order room service because we have to leave at 10 or 5 to 7. Um, we leave from the lobby at 6.55 but the food only would open at 7 so obviously I have to eat before so I'm going to order room for service for 6.15. I probably would only need it for 6.30, but just in case they're late, so I have it. So that's what I'm going to do. So that's it tonight, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for a really fun full day excursion.